though I never pumpkin like always. I've been practicing my magic all day and I don't have any of my spells right. Well, did you try using different rhymes? I have and nothing seems to work. Well, that's okay. Emma thinks you're doing amazing. <laughs> and so does Rocco. Rocco? But Rocco's just a rock. A very kind rock. <laughs> today, but, oh dear, I can't seem to find him. Well, did you check his nest? Yep. Um, yep. the laundromat? Yep, I checked everywhere, but he doesn't seem to be here. Who's not here? Here who's not? Who gone now? Well, my best friend in the whole wide world is missing. Who is a friend? Right to the end, who has two wings and even sings, who has a beak with which to speak. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, I think I know. Wait, my song's not through. Oh, okay. Who's always up for having fun? Who oh, can eat bird seed by the ton? Who oh, sleeps in, who oh, sleeps the best in a nest? Oh, oh, oh. Wait a minute. I think I know who it is, but uh, finish your song, just in case. Who's got the biggest beat you know? Who's got feathers from head to toe? Who's the fellow who's 
all yellow. Ho, ho, ho. Haven't you guys guessed yet? How about you guys out there? Do you know who's missing? Big Fred, that's who. It's a fairy tale. Fairy tales usually have happy endings. Yeah, there's never been one with a sad ending. Titanic. What? Down with the wind. Uh, no. That is a bargain. Oh, well, okay. <laughs> so tell them what happens next. Well, Bernie is teaching the beast how to be a good friend. But usually this is the end of the first half of my fairy tale. So Before the beast and I have our breakfast for dinner feast. Oh, okay. are a great audience. Right now, we're going to have a 15-minute intermission. See you soon. <laughs> 